All right, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of ASA, the series where I answer your questions. I got five questions today, so let's get started with E.K. Starlord. And he says, ASA, which is your favorite Star Wars animated show besides the Clone Wars? And then a whole bunch of potatoes. Thank you for the potatoes. I'm going to go with Star Wars Rebels because, first of all, Star Wars Rebels is actually very good. And if you haven't seen it, I would highly suggest it. But also, it's definitely the second best to the Clone Wars. The Clone Wars is obviously the best animated show hands down rebels is pretty good it has some pretty good story arcs i like star wars rebels star wars rebels is cool of course the clone wars is better but hey he said i'm not allowed to pick the clone wars so there you go next question is from wild realms salty asa what's up dude how's life and then a potato thank you for the potato honestly life is good right now you know how it goes life has its ups and its downs it's a bumpy ride sometimes life is like a roller coaster right sometimes you go up sometimes you go down sometimes you go kind of like sideways and life is just weird but I would say right now at this current time life is going pretty smooth so I guess that's a good thing so I would say it's going good next question is from Mr. Brick ASA are you secretly a Mr. Potato Head sadly I am not but that would be awesome because Mr. Potato Heads are a very cool toy I mean just look at it it's based off of a potato it's genius next question is from TG Collects ASA what is your biggest tip for making Lego videos so I'm very flattered that you ask me because I'm like I'm definitely not like one of the most popular lego youtubers ever i'm probably one of the very bottom ones right the fact that you're asking me for advice is just nice because it's like hey that's cool so i would say the biggest tip i've learned is to just do what you enjoy if you absolutely are like oh i hate this or you're like i don't want to make a video today then don't don't do it because you think you have to do it because you want to if you're not having fun if you're not enjoying it if you're not getting positive enough feedback or whatever to make it not not worth it then don't push yourself to do it no one's forcing you to do it i know that youtube has its perks and that some people can turn it into a job but let's be real youtube's supposed to be a hobby not a job so if you're just doing it because you want to try to make money someday you're probably not going to enjoy it you know and then my other tip for in terms of quality is lighting lighting is a very big difference i don't know if you record on a camera or a phone but get some lights if you don't have any <laughs> Why does it have to be so far away? I don't know what kind of Lego videos you want to make, like if you're talking about like animations, like stop motion or reviews or what. If you're doing stuff where it's like actual Lego in front of a camera, like on a table or something, get some lights. It really does help. So those are two tips. I don't know if they'll help you, but hopefully they do. And for anyone here that's not subbed to TG Collects, go sub to him. Help him get to maybe 110 subs. That would be a cool goal. If you're not subbed to him, do it now. And our last question is from... From Plorpus. ASA, do you know how many licks it takes to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Three! Take it or leave it! Okay. But Sky, that doesn't answer the question. To a study published in the Journal of Fluid Mechanics, it takes about 1,000 licks per centimeter of candy to reach the center of almost any lollipop. And based on that math, a Tootsie Pop, which is a little more than one inch in diameter, would need to be licked about 2,500 times. Shut your mouth, you mediocre news reporter. Mediocre? Anyways, that's going to do it for today's episode of ASA. So thank you all very much for watching. Thank you for leaving likes on this video. I know you did because you're awesome. Thank you for asking a question. Make sure you ask a question for the next episode, and I will pin my favorite to the top, which means you get to go first. Have a wonderful day, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.